Good morning. Today is Wednesday, April 29th, 2020, and we've made it through almost an entire month, entire month of April. So today you're going to be doing Read to Self. Remember, you're going to find a quiet place uh, where you can read the whole time and you're not interrupted. And make sure when you're finished, you tidy up because that's part of Read to Self too, is cleaning up our workspace when we're finished. Uh, after your reading today, you're going to be working again on your sight words, whether you can make some flashcards with them or write them in a funny way. But we're going to be practicing those words, uh, maybe each one three times. And paying close attention to that could, would, should words that have that crazy L in it. And those vowel teams, A-I in the word wait. So pay attention to those. You're also going to be working on a sheet where you're going to be sorting. We've been talking about verbs. And today you're going to be sorting verbs and nouns. Remember, a noun is a person, a word that is a person, a place, a thing, an animal, an idea. And a verb is a word that shows action, if it's something you can do. So you're going to be looking at those words and uh, you can either cut them out and glue them down onto the paper or you can use your journal and draw a line and separate noun verb and then um, write those words in on either side. So that, that either way you can, you can do that. Um, and then this is something that I would like you to take a photo of and upload to Seesaw today so that I can uh, take a look at that. Okay. Uh, for Writer's Workshop today, we're continuing with our ideas about our All About books. Remember, this is a book that you're going to be writing that you're an expert on. It's something that you know a lot about. Um, so you're going to be doing that, and I believe uh, the um, sheets are there for you to sort your ideas and to get started with your writing today. Um, you're also going to be going to this one website and working on an activity with fractions. Um, on Seesaw today, there's also a fun um, activity where you're going to be labeling the parts of a bird. And I have put in there the word, the parts of the bird in the word bank that I want you to use. And if you feel like it, you can add some other details too, some other words or parts that you know. Um, and that you've learned. So go ahead and do that today. And finally, there's a uh, art project um, where you're going to be making birds with out of paper or any other materials that you happen to have around your house. So um, that is there for you today. Um, I hope you have a good day. Work hard and be kind and I'll see you tomorrow.